Yo, YouTube, this is your boy Rob Coleman, comedian, coming at you. And what I have for you today is another trailer review video. Let's go ahead and uh, review trailer. Now, if you know me and um, you know me personally, you know I'm a big fan of scary movies and horror movies. And today, um, I was just looking through some different trailers. And before I wanted to, I wanted to watch the trailers with my genuine reaction because I haven't seen any of these trailers yet. And there's a ton of new scary movies coming out this year. Um, the one that I wanted to review with you guys today is a quick uh, trailer for a little ditty called uh, The First Omen. Now, um, I'm a big fan of uh, the, of the first omen. movie was made and it's considered one of the all-time great horror movie absolutely a classic i believe they made like three or four of them i think they got up to like maybe omen four or something like that before people got tired of it they even tried an omen tv show which um i actually had a chance to check out and it wasn't actually that that bad but um it only of course ran for um you know one season as most of these um uh you know movies will do but what we're going to look at is the uh first omen which uh this is the uh, movie poster for it as you can see here and uh i don't know um do they need to leave the omen alone i don't know they tried to relaunch the omen a few years ago um in 2006 like literally june 6 of 2006 they came out with a new omen movie that uh was basically they tried to remake the original omen and it basically crashed and burned i don't know what the numbers were but um it was it was pretty much just a bland remake of the original omen you know nothing new no new ideas or anything like that so what i want to do is take a uh, look at the trailer for this movie and uh see how it's gonna be so um Real quick, this movie is actually directed by a director named Akashka Stevenson. Um, this director has uh, done a lot of uh, TV and other movies. Um, Brand New Cherry Flavor is uh, uh, one of the movies that I saw in this director's credits. Um, I actually had a chance to check that out. It's kind of an odd short series that's on like uh, Netflix or Amazon. It's okay, you know, give it a watch, but um, it's not, you know, not super great, um, but pretty original. Um, this, uh, they also have other uh, TV credits uh, directing. Um, there was a little action uh, show a few years ago called Briar Patch, starring Rosario Dawson, that this director had a chance to direct a few episodes. And uh, Channel Zero, which is actually a very underrated horror um, TV show, kind of in the vein of a... Um, of a um, American horror story where each season was a different story that kind of played out for like eight or 10 episodes, however many of the episodes go. And this director actually directed several of the uh, season dream door uh, dream door was a, was one of the better seasons of the channel zero um, horror uh, series. So I'm not, I don't think channel zero is coming back, but there's actually uh, several episodes of that that you guys, if you're horror fans would definitely want to check out. So without further ado, Let's see if we can find this trailer and um, and take a look at it. I'm really excited, man, because The Omen is a great story if they do it right. Uh, that, um, you know, if they relaunch it and once again, if they do it right, could really get. I mean, think about it. The Omen series kind of led into politics eventually um, because Damien grew up and went to like some military academies and ended up getting into politics like by movie like two or three and i think was on verge of becoming the president if i'm not mistaken so how cool would that be if they took you know some of those ideas and led those into like you know current politics or whatever you know what i'm saying you know, you know red hats would have like some little horns on them or something i don't know it i just feel like they could have a lot of fun with it so um once again let's take a look at this uh uh trailer and uh see what we shall see uh and here it is here uh let's give it a watch and see what it looks like I'll see what tomorrow brings. 
You don't have to be afraid. This child is his way. Oh boy. Okay. April April 5th this is coming out. Uh I don't know. I feel like this is uh definitely just a teaser trailer. This is just to, you know, kind of get our whistles wet a little bit, but I'm, I'm kind of excited, you know, um the uh the the original omen was of course about Damien who was a a little boy that kind of discovered he was the son of, de of the devil. Um well no, he didn't discover it. His dad actually, you know, discovered it and um was warned about who damien was and you know throughout the movie ended up having to figure it out and having to kill damien like towards the end of the movie so <laughs> is this gonna happen in this movie i don't know this is the first omen right like so i don't know you know much about the plot or anything um well let's see let's see if they have a a, a plot synopsis uh let's see what they got on online here about it let's give you one sec here they have it as a young American woman is sent to Rome. <laughs> Let's pull it up. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. You know, do they need to stop making uh, remakes? Do they need to leave classics alone? Maybe I'll do a video one day about um, all of the stuff that uh, probably should be remade. Because there's actually a lot of great scary movies from um, like the 70s and 80s that would make some, uh, for some good, uh, remakes, um, you know, something like scanners or something like that. You know, I feel like scanners would be a good movie to remake that I, as far as I know, nobody has touched or anything like that. Um, once again, let's take a look at the, uh, synopsis and then we'll go ahead and wrap this video up. Um, the synopsis states that, It says here, an American woman sent to Rome to begin a life of service to the church, but encounters a darkness that causes her to question her faith and uncovering a terrifying conspiracy that hopes to bring about the birth of evil incarnate. Evil incarnate. Uh, that's a bad thing. So <laughs> um, I watch uh, movie reviews, but I'm not movie trailers, by the way, on IMBD. IMBD is a great place to go to uh, check out all the new movie trailers. If you are looking for actors bios or everything that an actor has been in, even the directors, writers, all of that stuff, you can find it pretty easy on IMBD if you don't already know about it. So are you excited to see uh, the uh, first omen? <laughs> are you excited for prequels? I mean, you know, prequels can be hard to do because somebody, you know, people are already like used to the main content. Are you guys uh, horror movie fans, you know, or, or do you not care for, you know, stuff like this? I don't know. Um, leave a message in the comment, but I'm very excited. Uh, I'm probably going to go ahead and get my ticket and uh, I'm going to check it out and maybe I'll do a review of it after I see it. But uh, thank you guys for listening. I hope you guys uh, get a chance to check the movie out and, um, you know, let me know what you think. I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs>